Hey YouTube, welcome to Rhonda's Glam Corner. Today, we will be doing my everyday makeup routine. So, if you would like to know how it was done, I would like you to sit back, relax, and keep watching. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad that you came to spend some time with me today. So I've already prepped my I I've already done my eyebrows and prepped my eyelids and today we are going to do and my everyday makeup routine. This is this this makeup look will be work appropriate, everyday appropriate. It could be also glam. It just depends on how you're feeling once you do it. So I am using, let me get my glasses so I can give you guys the exact exact description of what I'm using on my eye today. It is the, it's from Morphe. It's called the Filter Effect Finishing Powder. And it says filter number 14. And, and it is a finishing powder that's the color and that's what i'm going to use for my eyeshadow today And that's basically it for the eyeshadow. I am going to go off camera. I'm gonna do this other eye, do my eyeliner and my lashes, and I'll come back when it's time for me to do my foundation. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my concealer routine. Not my concealer, let me correct that. I'm gonna go ahead and do my primer routine. <laughs> The next primer will be my Fenty Mattifying Primer. And, and it's the same process. I am using my Fenty Pro Filter Matte Foundation in the color 440. And I'm not rubbing it like I normally do. And it's just because I don't want it to mix with the primer. I want it on top of the primer. Uh, and I hope that makes sense. And this is something new that I started and I feel like I get better coverage when I pat it in as opposed to that rubbing motion. The next step will be concealer. And 
And this is my everyday makeup routine. And this is actually what I do every day. I get up. So if if I'm if I'm leaving at 5 a.m., I get up at 3. And that's to make sure I have time to do everything that I want to do so I can feel how I want to feel before I leave, if that makes sense. So I am going to go ahead and get this buffed out. And I'll come back when it's time for me to put my powder on. And, and hopefully we have enough time for me to show you that. So, <clears throat> when you are blending out your concealer, take the other end of your sponge and go around the edges. That will soften them up. And it, it helps with you not having harsh lines. The only place that I don't do that is on my nose area here in, in this area because I do have that little thing there from my glasses and I do bring my concealer up to hide that and when I blend it it starts to show through and I don't want that. say this a lot but I hope you guys can see that so I'm going to go ahead and contour but for my everyday look I do not contour with the the stick I only use the powder and I'm using my Morphe Glamour Bronze and Leader Finding it to my forehead. I'm not bringing it this way. And I am using my Fenty loose powder and honey under my eyes, on my nose, my forehead, and my chin. And I'm not putting a lot of powder, just a little. One tap and covers everything. Now I am going to use that same Morphe Glamour Bronze to contour my nose. We are going to use our Fenty Pro Filter Loose Powder in Nutmeg, and we're going to hit the areas that we didn't put powder, any other powder. We're going to use our brush just to buff everything out. And and this is where <coughs> My foundation brush comes really comes in handy because with an everyday with my everyday look, I don't like my nose to be contoured so heavily. 
So that's this is what I do. So you can still see it, but it's subtle. And I hope that makes sense. So the next step would be my spray. And I will be back once it dries. And so, this is the finished look. This is my everyday makeup routine. This is what I do when I have to get up and get dressed to go to work. This is what I do every day. It, it's, it isn't quick, it's easy and simple. Just step by step, step by step. I have a routine. I do my routine and I love it. I just love the way my makeup came out. I, I just feel like when is COVID going to be over so we can go back outside? Honestly, because the only time I really put on makeup is when I'm doing a tutorial. <laughs> I used to wear makeup every day before and I really miss that. I mean, I'm saving money, which is a good thing, but that's it. I'm bored. I'm bored. But anyway, if you have any questions about this hair, I will put it at the end screen, but it will also be the video that I post after this one. So, we're coming to that time again where I have to say... Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as I always say, stay glamorous. Bye.